Hi everyone! Um, in this video, I'll be showing you my pamper routine, how I take care of myself on the weekend for maintenance, self care, and the weekend is my absolute favorite days because it's just about me, how I pay extra attention to myself. Um, the first step I do is I hop in the shower because dry shaving is really wrong please don't ever try this like don't ever you know the lack of lubrication can cause too much friction with these to irritation next cut and razor burn so please da, do not try it please just shower like shower before you try shaving your legs because that's what i'm doing right now then exfoliate some people are confused whether they should exfoliate um, before or after shaving and the right answer to it is before shaving because it removes the layer of the dead skin cells and the razor has a you know smooth canvas to glide on if you're prone to razor bulbs this step will help you a lot the third step is lubrication please grab um, a shaving soap or a shaving gel or cream because it's going to provide enough lubrication for your razor to glide more easily in your skin but please bar soap tend to be really drying and can create build up on your razor you know while while it increases your chances of getting cut you can also reach for your hair conditioner i mean <laughs> it's actually a very good alternative for shaving cream who knew and it's very smooth on the skin as well you can actually try that um, so while shaving, please don't use a single blade razor because they're not ideal. It causes um, the blade to drag on your skin. So when you get a razor that has more blades, it gives you a smoother finish and helps your skin from getting grated. The last step rinse dry and moisturize shaving is another form of exfoliating right but moisturizing important you need to moisturize your legs with lotion or body oil to prevent red bombs from appearing on your skin for my skincare routine i apply the face smoothing face scrub on on my wet skin and prevents blemishes it takes for least to help leave the skin smooth and soft and after i'm done scrubbing I, I use my charcoal peel off mask which helps me you know clear white or black heads um, it cleanses the skin from oil and dirt it's you know gives the skin smooth and lighter and this um, after finish like really really soft after finish While I'm done with that, I, I use a moisturizer for demo planning. And this moisturizer is, 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 oh my God, it's wonderful because it's so cool and it protects and moisturizes the skin. So it's like all in one. I, I use that, I use it to shave and I use it as a moisturizer because it gives this 24 hours hydration and has an antioxidant, you know, feature in the moisture. So while i shave my face i i i do it in a downward direction i shave down and i try to you know keep my blade in an angle form so that it just you know takes out the 
dead skin the dead skin cells from my skin right next one after i'm done with the my planning i use my aloe vera hydrating sheet mask oh my gosh it's so hydrating and brightening it moisturizes dry skin moisturizes dehydrated skin oh god it locks in water it improves hydration and gloss and makes your skin more elastic tender and beautiful so it helps with redness you know like a lot of qualities it's so calming so all you have to do is just unfold the mask apply it to your face gently pat it against your face and leave it for about 30 minutes so that the mask essence will absorb in your skin then take off the mask wash your face with water you know and discard the used mask but most of the time i don't actually wash my face with water afterwards i use the mattifying face lotion and it's designed to help with lightweight um hydration it leaves your skin perfectly mattified and not and reduces the shine one i use is the eye cream and the eye cream is really anti-aging it helps to reduce crow feet under eye bags and wrinkle so it just helps with dehydration and dark circle as well has a lot of quality like boosting collagen you know and gives this light reflecting particles and you know moisture it also contains a bit of ca caffeine which helps lock in moisture in your eye area and the last step the last step is the face the day cream which has spf 20 so it's so good because it gives this flawless radiant complexion and leaves your skin really soft and moisturized it helps with um environmental stress pollution uv damage and and premature aging so it just works to feed hyperpigmentation like like dark spots in your skin and helps prevent dark spots from forming thank you for seeing this video to the end um just like subscribe and keep you know watching or turn on the notifications so that anytime i drop content like this you get to receive it have a lovely day take care of yourself if you don't take care of yourself nobody will do it for you so you have to take care of yourself bye